Hello everyone. Welcome. Intention, intention of this vi video is clear. I would like to keep you company and keep talking about what is really worrying the whole world right now so we can uh, help each other and uh, raise um, public awareness of um, seriousness. We have to save the world right now. So, um, I, you know, like one voice means a lot. However, tarot cards often, it's an instrument. Don't get skeptical. I, I know it's probably not that popular, but we all have to have open mind right now. And tarot often shows what is not visible. So in a, in a light of today's um, events, events, war, world events, I will ask tarot clear questions and we will get, I hope, clear answers. Two questions here I will raise. What about Article 5 and how um, NATO will um, strategically defend countries, people, NATO, NATO countries and also the whole world? Uh, and also, this is first first card. Second question would be concerning China, but I, I'm going to ask f about Article 5. It's a very good card. It says that um, NATO officials will have um, a response, and this response will be uh, clear and loud, because sun in Taro means clear and loud. Clear and loud. Also, sun means vitality and peace and um, you know, conquer the evil, what, um, what is going on now with Putin's regime, trying to uh, conquer Ukraine and threatens the whole world. So this flag means that, um, yes, uh, the whole world is defending uh, itself. It, our task is uh, righteous. It's a righteous defending. So NATO is um, going to have a very clear uh, message to Putin's regime and at the same time, I see in this card that um, NATO will have smart, wise decision because, of course, Sun card means wisdom. There are lots of um, allergy here. <laughs> Not allergy. No, I forgot the word. Metaphor. Maybe metaphor is the right word. Sorry, who doesn't know I am Ukrainian-Canadian and <laughs> three languages goes in my head simultaneously, so forgive me, please. So lots of metaphor here, this, um, this metaphor of a child on, on, a, on a horse means the child is a new world that is emerging right now, a new world. It's like a child asking, help me to live, help me to survive. And this is very, very significant now, this child on a horse means the, the whole earth is like a child emerging from from ashes of old way of a Cold War and everything, emerging to the new world of, of happiness, of vitality, of free, fair trade and everything else. So a new world that uh, will conquer the hunger and will lead us to better future for our children and grandchildren. Uh, the horse is white here, so that means um, empty of empty of old ways um, doing things. So this blank, it's not even white, I would say blank. The horse, the horse is blank, it has no color. So no color horse, uh, horse represent movement and no color represents that uh, it is movement to new world with new rules that aggression will be uh, seized right away uh, without waiting until it's so big. Like the, the war in Ukraine started in 2014 and you see where it led because everyone was afraid to touch it. So that's what, what it is. Uh, about Article 5, this question, because I will remind you, but you of course know that Article 5 in NATO means if someone attacks one of NATO countries, uh, that means um, it's understood as um, it is attack for all NATO countries and uh, they will defend um, uh, each each doom, let's say each each uh, you know each um, a little piece of of anything, uh, and it's it's a very fair game, of course. A son talks about uh, us living in NATO countries, 
I, I live in Canada, write in comment where you come from. It's very, very important for me because I, I want to know, I want to know you. I, I freely show me, my, my home in Vancouver, uh, very open to conversation. So let me know where are you from. It's a good card. And this card, the decision of NATO will be very smart. We have to trust it. Let's uh, pull another card. And this, um, another card, we'll talk about China, in involvement of China. We all know that China is neutral uh, somehow in this situation, although I say uh, from the first day of war, I said that it's not time to be neutral. It's time to uh, decide, are you for progress, for peace, or are you, are you for backward, so to speak, um, when, when uh, when weapons are talking. So um, China being neutral, um, they have their own interest. We don't know what Tara will tell us. Um, and we know that China, of course, trades with the whole world, including Russia, including Ukraine, including, including NATO countries. But the thing is that Putin asked China not only for weapons, also for economical help. Um, let's see why Putin asked China. Uh, because it's like a green bush, right? The seven of pentacles means green bush. Putin is waiting until new money are coming and we don't know where he's waiting money from, but we're sort of guessing, right? So um, he's waiting for new money coming, coming, uh, money coming one by one, but not at once, but he needs at once, he needs a lot of money. And um, to continue this ass assault on Ukraine and this war, so he runs out of money. It's sort of a good sign. And this card says, Putin, pull back, pull back, immediately pull back, because it's green. It's, I mean, this, this bush will never ripen. You're waiting uh, for something to ripen. It will never ripen. Putin, uh, pull back. And you know, Russian folks that are, um, you know, in, in, um, in another war, because if you look uh, here, um, you will understand that the Russian people, the war there is a propaganda war, and propaganda ro um, war has own weapons. These weapons are shooting at people's brain, at people's mentality, at people's thinking, at pe people's decisions. So they, they experience mental war. I would not say that it's equal of bombs that are falling on Ukrainian heads, this is not equal at all because people losing their life, right? However, this card says loud and clear, Putin pull immediately back. Stop the war, stop attack and pull immediately back. That's what I see. But also he needs help from China, it says here. So he's running out of money, which is a good sign because you don't, you don't want money to be invested in war. This is total, total disaster. This is completely like Middle Ages, um, Stone Ages thinking, and it has to be stopped. But what will China do? Oh, em emperor, China's emperor, right? China feels and it is an emperor in a way. Oh, so, 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 so are other countries have, have its own power of wisdom, power of, of love, power of, you know, economical, um, economical trades, fair trades, and, and China on one hand uh, is for fair trades and it, we, we respect that because that's what, uh, this, this is the way to, to do it in the future. However, uh, this emperor has, uh, has warrior suits, uh, in, um, you know, so China sort of um, plays now, like sits on two, on t on two chairs. And the emperor said that, yes, it has its own interest, it has its own secret, because emperor never tells secrets uh, on, too open to people. So the emperor is, um, that's a presentation of China, and really to the whole world, which is we are looking, we don't even breathe, because, I mean, uh, it's so unfair that we are scared of, uh, we are scared uh, so badly, it's not fair. Uh, you know, uh, 
so we all look at, uh, looking at China now because uh, China has lots of power and uh, what China decide will definitely will be very important to everyone decision um, what to expect next in in Ukraine because we all want to stop fire this is what important you see this is an excellent card it's two of ones and it's you see this is like Ukraine this figure represents Ukraine and this figure uh, th these two um, ones uh, or or sticks they represent two forces one forces as i mentioned for future progress and fair trade and everything and peace another is representing something else that that threaten us they wants to stop it all and yes these are two forces now and ukraine uh, holds them the world, the, the world uh, on its hand. So Ukraine now is paying with real lives. Um, we have to find solution as soon as possible. This card also shows that um, it holds to one want and the back, on the back of this figure in the center is another force. This force might mean uh, old ways of doing things the ways of wars, the ways of um, gaining territory uh, by forcing um, or to another sovereign country. This is old school. It's a stone age school. It's old school of doing things. And it, it, it's not there, it doesn't exist anymore. So before uh, this old way of thinking, of way of doing things dies, it, it just rises to the fullest its aggression. But it could be Ukraine, it could be also you and me, it could be the whole world. And the, the world, um, you know, the planet on, on the palm of the hand is holding to the new progress to, to move forward um, to the new um, world that there is no threat of bombs. Uh, there should be formed a new world. There will be never such threat. I also I want to here to take this opportunity, first of all, uh, to say to my Ukrainian people who now experience horror of war, I say Slava Ukraini and Heroem Slava. And everyone, even in, in, in Canada, everyone knows those words and they say it um, every possible nation in Canada, uh, when they, they see me walking, they say hi and Slava Ukraini, Heroem Slava. They don't know Ukrainian, but that's what they say. And it's solidarity of the whole world. We are with you and the truth will win. I also would like to, to take this opportunity to speak to Russian speaking people who live in immigration, who live abroad, like, like you know, many people from 15, um, so to speak, Soviet uh, republics that uh, flee uh, th their homeland f for, for, for personal reasons or political reasons, for any reasons, uh, let us also join for peace. And also I would like to take this opportunity to speak to Russian, uh, Russian people from all around the globe, uh, immigrants, new, and, uh, new immigrants and people who f flee the country before. Uh, also, let us all join together for peace and, and try, try to, in our little, little way, help the, the planet now. Um, thank you for understanding. For, thank you for not being uh, angry and rude to me, because I receive lots of comments, um, extremely rude, uh, attacking uh, on, on me, uh, although this is nothing even close to the attack that uh, people are getting in Ukraine. Although I'm saying that I cannot delete all of those comments. It's too many, too many. It's the multi multitude of attack. It's like, you know, Lord of the Ring, when you see those evil forces, it's raising and, and there are such multitude. So if you find some comments um, under my video that I just didn't have time to delete, uh, so don't pay attention. Um, and um, God bless you. God or higher power, um, whatever your belief is, um, and um, goodness. Um, I might believe in goodness. In goodness, I'm agnostic. I'm not really religious. I say goodness will will prevail and win. Um, take care of yourself. Take good care of yourself, and uh, we all take care of our planet. I will see you tomorrow if um, fate 
allows us to meet again. And um, I, I do welcome your comments, your, your, your words are so important for me. Uh, so, um, see you tomorrow. Bye for now.